So, I'm sitting here near the finale of my, what I would think would be him's everyday look. And almost everything I've recorded, for whatever reason, has like erased. So I'm hoping I can get it back, but if y'all only get to see the beginning of this video, just know I wanted y'all to catch the end. Um, and we're gonna do this again. <laughs> hey, what's up? So welcome back to my channel. Just to start off, I'm going to be using some Aqua Paint by Ben Nye. This is an amazing product. I absolutely love it. This product is water activated, so you really want to blend it in until you get this thick paste. However, guys, be careful, because if you put too much water, it just becomes this runny mess, and it's difficult to work with. Here, what I did is I grabbed the lid of my aqua paint and I took off the excess water onto there so that I could go ahead and go back into my aqua paint and make the paste again. And this helped me get the opaqueness I wanted again just to get that like nice thick texture going. It goes on there really nice. It's still something you're gonna want to build onto, so you're definitely gonna have to dip in and make this paste a couple of times, just because it thins out and it doesn't give you the pigmentation you want. So I went ahead and I put this all over my face and my neck. I wanted to really just get some coverage going. I wasn't going to initially put it on my eyes. I didn't want to irritate them, but I went in ahead and I kind of patted some on there just so that it could like add some opaqueness to it while I put eyeshadows on. I don't know about y'all, but I'm like really crazy about things looking solid. So I just kept doing this until I personally felt like it was just the right amount of opaque and just exactly what I wanted. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, at this point I was feeling kind of spooky. Unfortunately, the brows, eyes, and lips were not recorded. So, I will have to record that in a separate video. What I did is I went ahead and I took my Love Plus by Sugar Pill and I used that as a contour. I used it all over the eyes as well. It wasn't dark enough to mess up the look and it just kind of started building the natural contours. Next, I decided to go ahead and take Love Sick for my Melt Cosmetics palette. It is a little darker so it adds some nice shadow to really start creating depth and it mixed in really well with Love Plus. Finally, I decided to go ahead and dip back into Love Plus and do a little bit nose contouring, making sure that I was looking on a fleek. Yeah, it's actually a lot of nose contouring. <laughs> And that was the moment I realized. <sighs> this is so annoying. Yeah, literally two hours of work and and that's all down the drain. I'm trying to do like him. Like I'm trying to do like a like the Powerpuff Girls, the villain. Y'all know who that is? No? I'll have to redo it again. And this is supposed to be like part of a, like a five part series leading up to Halloween, but um, this was supposed to be like an everyday him look, like if he wakes up and what he puts on. But yeah, like I, I wanted to make it like more gory as time went by so that around Halloween when I do him, I could have like prosthetics, blood, teeth, but I'm gonna have to start over. Also, if you're not subscribed, subscribe. Other than that, yeah, like, Come hang out with me and just, you know, I don't know. I'm going to keep trying to like improve my skills. Uh, this is something I wanted to do originally. But I don't know. You know when you just start, uh, I overthink things. More of the stories. I'm trying to get into it now. So, yeah, like I'm super excited. So thank you for, for you know, just the support. <laughs>
I put too much work for this to not be shown off, right? Show, turn it to the free show.